Sit. I would just eat until I'm dead, probably. A normal day for me is wake up around 12, figure out something I'm gonna eat immediately. TV, video games, bed. It's not a lot of activity. It's hot, it's hot in Georgia. And all my clothing is restricting and tight. So I just sit in there naked, free as can be, and no one bothers me, door shut, we're good. I'm just safe. And video games are where I escape. Oh no, he's got it. Oh God, he's got that one gun that's gonna kill me. Oh no, he's weak, but I'm weak, I'm weak. Oh, I'm gonna die. He's down. All right, I gotta go in the kitchen and get uh, stuff. All right, I'll be right back. I'm accepted in all those virtual reality worlds and the gaming world I'm in. No one sees me. No one sees me. That is my outside. That is my world that I can be the Casey I want to be, but not be judged on my weight. I never would have thought at 34, I'd be living with my father and I'd be, have no job, have no real money and just be playing video games all day and eating. I've always been a big kid. Out of high school, I was probably 300 something pounds. But then I got out of school, got a couple of jobs at a couple of restaurants. I ate at them. I was probably around 500 pounds then, and uh, it was just getting too difficult to work, so I quit my job. My mom said, to live in this house, you have to have a job. So she kicked me out, and I, the only place I had left to go was my father's. So I went there. Basically, his one thing that knew made me happy was food. So we just ate like kings, but like in the worst way. Pizzas, chicken, Japanese food, takeout. I mean, me and my dad would get hibachi delivered, sushi by the barrel. I mean, just anything you wanted to eat, we were getting. 